Hello Dwarves, welcome back, I am Parthas and this is Dwarf Fortress. Let's continue the active game. So here is our fort above ground. There to draw a bridge. Now, from what I've read on the wiki, the the, uh, the doors, they don't do anything. It offers like no protection, so an enemy can come along, even, even if we lock it and forbid it, an enemy can come along and just go down. So the only protection we're gonna have is this drawbridge if we get it working. At the moment we don't have it working, it's just sitting there open because we can't build any levers because we don't have any mechanisms. Let's go down a layer. That's where the farms are. Oh yes, yes, we've run out of plump helmets so we can't make any crops which can be brewed into drinks. Ah, uh, what a, a thing. And the, what we're planting here is um, we're wasting our time doing it actually because these are something else. I can't remember the name of them now, but they are something else that just makes dye or something. So we wanted to make a lever here in this little uh, alcove, but uh, yeah, no mechanisms. So we need to make mechanisms. And I think it's like two mechanisms to make a lever. Apparently the work orders are not getting done for whatever reason. What we'll do is I'll add task. If I add a task, make rock mechanism. So we can make them out of rock. We don't need metal or anything, because that's good. Make rock mechanism. And if we just do that, um, I don't know, six times? That should probably enough for our needs if we can get them. If they can't make them for whatever reason, an alert should pop up here. Tell us why they can't make it. Let's see if that's a thing. Oh, actually, looking up here, this has already happened last game. Carpenter Council's make rock mechanisms needs non-economic hard rock. So we don't have any rocks. Oh, I mean, that should be easy enough. We'll just dig some more out. I think we'll dig down again and we'll go... We, what we've been told, we are dwarves and apparently we're digging quite high up. So the, the, the layers we've got are obviously the, the surface level, the farm, down again is our storage area and workshops. Down again is our bedrooms and tavern area, which has been smoothed out nicely so far. Let's hopefully that starts pleasing people in a little uh, barracks area. Uh, down again is our um, crypt area and then that's it. That's it. So let's dig like down 10 layers and maybe we'll find some things which might be a bit you know some gems or something i don't know let's go down 10 more layers so if we go and also we need the stone to make the mechanisms so there and then dig spiral to get stairwell on this level going up or down yeah let's do that so click on there and then go down one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there and uh, ten layers down scary times going deep going deep okay well let's see if they will do that i mean that in itself should help actually let's when we yeah, when we yeah when we get to there which is the last one down let's go and dig out uh, a passage and just see what that lets us see i suppose so that'll be elevation at 34, so 34 down from the top. So the surface is level 40, 48, yeah, okay, and that's, you can you can build upwards as well if you needed to. Or right, let's just, um, oh, before we unpause the game, what I'd like to do, because we've run out of seeds for the plump helmets, potentially we've been cooking with them. I don't know if that's a thing we've actually been doing or not, but uh, do what we have been cooking with the actual plump helmets though, we should probably have saved them for brewing. I'm going to turn off, I think, even cooking with plump helmets. Maybe I'll try out biscuits. <laughs> and you, tell, you can tell if it's a male uh, steel trout, a female, uh, female steel trout biscuits. At least the fishing's paying off. Yeah, so anyway, I don't know if... Uh, but we've run out of plump helmets anyway. So let's go to, I think it's task. And then there's a kitchen one, apparently. Or labour, and then kitchen. I've not been to this one before. I think it's... It looks like all the seeds are restricted anyway. You can't cook with the seeds. So uh, maybe we, we wasn't cooking with the seeds. Are we cooking with, we're cooking with the with the drinks. River spirits. Yeah, no cooking the alcohol. I don't know if you are doing that or not, but no cooking the alcohol. Meat and fish. Water buffalo's milk. We got, we got 10 of those. Let's add a broker because uh, for negotiations. I don't know who's going to be best at it. This guy will be adequate apparently. Use the appraisal skill. Um, yeah, so adequate appraiser. This guy will be a skilled appraiser though. Novice. Yeah, this one's skilled. So this list it, whoever his name is, can be the um, the broker with his appraiser skill. A bookkeeper apparently would help with um, 
knowing what items we've got. So if we can find one, there's nobody, no relevant skills. Uh, maybe does anyone can do it then? Maybe the animal trainer, because he's not doing too much right now, can do it. Yeah, you, know, you can be. What's this button? So these guys would like a study. The bookkeeper, the manager, and expedition leader would all like a study. But I mean, we'll get around to that one day, I'm sure. But I mean, that's that's okay. I think we just need to buy more seeds. So uh, seeds, plump helmet seeds is going to be the most important thing. Let's unpause and see if we the guys will dig out some stone in order to make those levers. Let's go down a level. Are these guys, they are digging out. They are look, they are digging out these. They're coming down. They're digging out. I don't know if they're enjoying it or not. It's got to the lowest level. It's got to level ten. And here we are. They're just digging around. Looks like any other place. Rough hewn mudstone wall. Mudstone? Mudstone? That's not great. Let's dig out an area and just see what it's like. This could be like the temple. What, they did want a temple. A temple might improve, improve mood, perhaps. I don't know if it was a mud, mud wall temple, but it's mudstone at least. So maybe it's like petrified mud. I don't know. The people are picking up those rocks, which is good, but nothing brilliant down here so far. Maybe we'll try and go down again. So from there, down one, two, let's get down to like, we're at 34 now. We just get down to, this getting towards zero now. 24? See what happens there? Oh, I'm a bit scared to go down too far. I do, I have heard that there's, it, there's some dangers if you dig too deep, like in um, Lord of the Rings. Oh, they've, they've done it. I think they've just actually got there. All right, it's doing a similar one over here. We are very deep now. What's this, what's this wall? Rough hewn granite wall. Okay, proper granite now. Strong stone. This would probably be a good temple. Yeah, it's going to make a big old, uh, it's going to be the temple. I like the pink look of this granite. People are coming to collect all this good stuff. Okay, right. Can we make play zones? I don't know how you do it. Meeting area. Is it, is it a type of meeting area? Yeah, meeting area. This important zone is where your citizens will gather to socialize. Crucially, the meeting area is where locations such as taverns, temples, hospitals, and the like are established. So yeah, I want that, please. And uh, we're going to stick a lot of that. Just accept it. Do I choose? Do I not get to choose what type it is? Okay, reading the wiki. Temples require an empty floor space called a dance floor. Minimum surface of 25 tiles. The same as taverns. Performers can also be assigned to temples to perform sacred dances. I'm wondering if um, our tavern's 25 tiles. Okay, well, that's seven by seven, I think. So that's 49. So I think we're good. We're probably good for the tavern as well, honestly. New temple. Let's go. <laughs> I don't know which de de deity, so let's go for um, no specific deity. All visitors are welcome, or only us, or us as long uh, as long term residents only, or all everybody. Yeah, it's open to everybody. Everybody, we're very welcoming. Shrine. Okay, so it starts off as a shrine level. No worshippers. Only organized religions can have recognized priesthoods. So we need to put a chest in there. Chest in common area. Uh, and that they would like some instruments, whether we have any, any or not. And we could put a performer down there. Okay, well, let's put a chest in there. Right, let's stick um, some furniture down. I don't know what a temple would like to have, honestly, but let's stick... Uh, okay, let's let's um, see if we can smooth this area out where the temple is. Make it nice for them. Furniture, how about a chest? Yeah, closest one. We'll stick it, we'll stick it there. Yeah, one of those pine chests. Lovely. Be lovely. See what they uh, get up to. This might take a while for them to smooth all that out. Right, have we made any levers? Oh, look at this red stuff. Rock salt wall. Okay. Limestone. Mudstone. Siltstone. Chert. Back up to this level. Rock salt mechanisms. Okay, we do have some mechanisms now. Um, see if we can make a lever. Let's stick it there. Oh, we've got three mechanisms. Yes, let's do the uh, let's do that one there. And pause. That'd be great to have that lever in. 
to, to be able to have the work in. I don't know, I think we need more mechanisms to connect the lever once it's in to the drawbridge. But that would be a good thing to have. You guys, who are you? Who are you? Why are you so, um, why are you so, um, armoured up? She was worried about being kept from alcohol for too long. Okay, she felt fresh pleasure remembering a fine trade. Yeah, she, she wants her alcohol. We're going to stop doing dimple cups because that's the ones, we just want plump helmets. Plump helmets is all we need. Oh, the lever's in, the lever's in. Link lever. Click a building to link the siltstone lever. And it requires those mechanisms, which hopefully we have. And click this building here. Link to the pine bridge. Has it been done? Just, what was that? Is that, is that a link in it? Oh no, a baby's been born. Is it? Lead has been given to birth to a baby boy. We got a new baby. A new dwarf, our population's up to 14, everybody. If no, if nobody's gonna come to join our fort, we'll breed our own dwarves. Rose quartz, that looks great. Where's the rose quartz? Ah, rose quartz. Do you know what? I think we'll have some of that. I think we'll have some of that. Let's um, see if we can get some rose quartz. I guess everybody's busy doing the uh, working on the temple and such likes. There we are, dwarven baby. Ma, <laughs> low self-esteem. Oh dear. Uh. Link lever. Oh, it's already been done. Pull lever. Will someone pull the lever? Oh, look! It's links. Oh, great. Look, we've done it, peeps. We can actually raise the drawbridge. So now all we need is a higher wall because our wall is only, um, our wall is only one high. That's why you go up one level, it's got snow on top. So yeah, if anything, if nothing else, we shall cocoon ourselves in by creating a higher wall. I think we should probably have some chirp blocks. So let's build constructions, a wall, one level up. So yeah, let's go for over here. Need materials. Basically we need, we need to mine more. I'll right, stop making mechanisms now. Let's turn that off. I don't want any more mechanisms made. We've got enough. If we need more, we'll uh, ask for some. Down to 20 drinks, which is not great. These are the empty barrels. They should have plants in, but it doesn't. Oh, the dining hall. I just realized that the dining hall is not a tavern. I think we're gonna make a new one. I kept thinking this was a tavern, but it's a dining hall. I'm not sure that's the same thing. Probably wanna know who's putting cups and stuff in there. Okay, we're gonna make this into a dedicated tavern. And whether it's good enough or not, I don't know, but that's gonna be the tavern area. And that will help to get some more stone, because I think we need some stone. What are these guys doing? I don't know what these guys are doing. This might have made a nice tab, uh, temple area. Quite like the rough old oh, rock salt wall. While we're here, let me just make sure that we're not storing, because there are like dead rats and stuff here, rotten remains. Now, the tutorial told me to make this stockpile, but apparently... Having sentence thing to all is not the best thing. Custom. Let's not have dead things, shall we? Do you know what? Maybe I don't want food in there. Food in the dedicated stockpile. So no food in there. Hang on. How do I turn it off? No food in there. No, 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 no corpses in there, please. I think that's probably enough. I think that's probably it. Oh, refuse. Yeah, no refuse in there, please. No body parts and bones and such likes. None of that, please. Anvils. Is that refuge? Hang on. We can have. No, we can have anvils. No, yeah, we can have all of that. We can have item types, but no corpses, no body parts, no skulls, no bones, no sh shells. Do you want shells? Probably make stuff out of shells, but no teeth, no horns, no hair. Oh, I mean, that's not really... Hair on wall? We can probably have some of that. Maybe we'll have a stockpile of skulls one day, I don't know. I think that's it. Good. That's a good stockpile now. That's a food one. Okay, we're sorting out some of the stockpiles to stop having the unnecessary rubbish in now all stockpiles. Now all the food should be brought down to here, so we can keep an eye on how much food we've got. We're sorting out the stockpiles now, are we arranging it all? Plant barrel. Oh yeah, because the plants are getting up there, they should be down here. Okay, well that's the food stockpile at the moment. Um, probably want to really create another one just for drinks and stick it like that. Oh, there's an offshoot here because that's gonna they're gonna brew it there 
I think I wanted the plant matter there, didn't I? And that was meant to be the finished food. Yeah, no, okay, I don't want any plants, I don't want any seeds. I want to keep track of these seeds. So no seeds there, no plants in there. And you stop piling, just this area here is going to be for seeds. Just seeds. None apart from seeds, and then all the seeds. All the seeds! What we're waiting for now is spring, so we can either pick some berries and stuff to make more wine, or for a trader to come by so we can trade and buy some seeds to grow some seeds. Because we're down to 10 drinks, things are looking dire right now. In fact, it won't be until summer until we can actually, uh, until the river's unfrozen. What is this? Tips him. Okay, new stockpile. Except that this is only going to be, only going to be for drinks. Drinks from animals and drinks from plants. Nothing else. Not a thing, not a sausage. I shall name these because I'm going to start forgetting. Drinks. Seeds. Oh. Okay, we can see what seeds we've got now. Sweet pods. Oh, another baby's been born! A baby girl! Yes! Oh, down by the, um... Down by where the temple's gonna be. Are you the baby girl? Dwarven baby. Oh, it's down over here. I guess they're carrying, bit getting carried around by the mama. Got a dwarven child. See, the dwarven child's working. Stores the item in the bin. Oh, nice. Got one sleeping. I hope you're still alive. Are oh, you going to sleep? A population 15! Okay, we've got the um, the drawbridge up, but that's okay because winter. We don't really need to be doing things. If we can be building now, it'd be great. I don't know if we dug enough stone out and and made enough uh, bricks and stuff yet, but... Oh, one of our dwarves has become a cook. Okay, we've got a bit less unhappy dwarves now, so we're up to like six kind of like meh. And then three of them, are, four, four or five of them are really good, really like happy and only... Uh, and a similar amount unhappy, so we're getting more, uh, you know, tolerable situations here. I think they just like digging. So I think what we need to do, actually, is... Got a lot of... what are these? Okay, so we've got some rocks, but we don't have, um, bricks. So let's build... let's get the stone mason work, uh, making bricks. Okay, let's change it to 50 work... Uh, 50 rock blocks. Because, uh, they're making 10 quite easy. Or maybe we need 100, I don't know. Have a hundred blocks ready to go. That's fifty fifty. Okay, we have made ten rock blocks, so can we make any part of wall here? How much would that take? Nine non economic items. Well we'll see tomorrow if they make it. But down to seven drinks, this is not good. Here's the uh the temple area. Still nothing in the chest. But uh, it is a temple, and they can come here to pray if they want to while they're doing it. If they, you know, it's a shrine actually. It's a shrine. So if we go to the zones, and I click on this. No worshippers. The shrine's got a hundred fanciness, I think. And it needs two thousand fanciness. Hopefully, with all the um, when we've engraved it and stuff, the, the fanciness will go up. Who knows? It's midwinter, in the year one zero one. I like this kind of uh, red area though. This would make a nice kind of um, temple. Maybe a different kind of temple there. To a particular s deity. What are you guys doing? Oh, they're smoothing the floor. No? No, no, they're not. No job. Just, just loving life. Oh, yeah, this was going to be the tavern. Okay, so zone it out again. A meeting area. Uh, let's go for there. Let's accept it. Let's choose what kind of meeting area. Let's go for a new inn slash tavern. And in there, probably we want to have tables and such likes. Maybe we'll just move a couple of these tables into there. Call it a tavern. <laughs> uh, can, I, can we do that? I don't know if we can move stuff. All we've got for now though is a chest, so let's take a chest in there. Oh, have you come to drink? Oh, they come to recite poetry! <gasps> And it's listening to poetry. Oh, what a lovely moment we're witnessing. The dogs come to listen to the poetry, the socialising. He's constructing the, uh, the, 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 the thing. The socialising. Yeah, it's brilliant. Even the dogs are loving it. What are you doing? No job, but... Okay. It's like poetry. Okay, so there's a nice poetry corner. Not, I mean, this is probably what we should have had. I think what we're going to do is make some um, tables and such likes. 
Oh look, make a rock altar. We probably need that for the shrine slash temple. Can we make instruments at the stone place? Whatever this is, I don't know what that is. But we'll have. I'll make. Do you know what? I'll make a couple of those. What are these things? Raw body. Oh, they're just like a body part of an instrument. They're not like a whole instrument. I'll tell you what. Let's just make one then. See how it goes. And let's make make an altar. We're gonna need one of those. We'll make a statue. No, we need to. We need to get the tables done. Tables. I was thinking a statue could, could go in the um, the temple slash shrine area. But yeah, two yeah, two tables for now because I, I want to get it a functional. Two tables and then some seats or something. Chairs. Can I can I do chair or stool? Okay, I didn't know what a quern was. Apparently, it's for grinding corn. So it seems like we can make tables at that place, but we can't make um. We can't make chairs. Chairs need to be made with wood, apparently. Okay, I'm asking to make. I'm asking them to make four wooden chairs. I don't think they will because we don't have any. We don't have any wood. If we can tell them to cut down some trees, maybe they'll do it. Cut down these trees here. But we'll have to open up the ta the place with. Let's see if any dwarves can do it. I don't know if they can or not. What's all this stuff doing up here? Have we got traders here or something? What's, why is there loads of stuff on the on the counter? Oh, so oh, a, a human, a human, a human is visiting. Human mace man, visiting. What are you doing? What are you doing? You come to see the tavern. You got, got two lovers and two children. Just gonna stand up there. Are you coming down now? Just slowly coming over. Okay, well, if we see him again, we'll know who he is. Who are you, child? Let's. Let's bring the broker to the um, the depot because I don't know why all this stuff's up here. Okay, so we've got this guy here. If I'm, if anybody knows why all this stuff is still in the trade depot, let me know because I haven't got a scooby doo, not a clue. Because there's no one here to trade with. There's no merchants trading right now. Okay, no trader needed then. Why is all that stuff there? All right, let's um. Oh, do you know what? That human probably can't come in because we've got the uh, the lever down. Let's pull the lever again. See if someone pulls that lever. He's doing it. And that should open up this door. There we go. Open up the door. Now, can that human come in now? You're going to come in now. He's going to walk around that area. Oh no, you're making your way. Let's, let's follow you. Uh, follow you. There he is. The left hand side there. It's human macement. Coming in. Now the tavern, now the, uh, oh, it's going all the way down. Where's he going? Where's he going? Oh, he wants to go to the shrine. So I'll look around the shrine. He's like, oh, this is where the dwarves hang out. Oh, we're here to tavern. There's no alcohol in there. Okay, we're going to, I'm going to go back down the shrine because that was, uh, that was interesting down there. Now I'm going to. No, I'm, I'm done. So I'll see you later. Slatter dwarves. <laughs> it's been a blast. What was his thoughts? Grouchy caught in a snowstorm. He watched the performance. He felt fondness remembering talking with an acquaintance. He felt fondness talking to an acquaintance. He was content after putting a well crafted item. I think he's going to go after the map now. Okay, well that was alright. That was uh, a successful visit. I thought he'd stay longer, but he didn't like the. I guess we. Do you know what? I think we need to put a barracks in the tavern again. We should have had. We should have had tables and stuff. Um, furniture, tables. Let's get some jet tables. Yes, jet table. Okay, cool. Uh, and I don't think that's it. Okay, and then chairs, but we're completely out of uh, water again. Um, okay, I don't know how long it'll last now that we've uh, completely ran out of water. Um, uh, this is not good, not good at all. No water and no way to brew. We're still in winter, late winter. Is there any way we can just dig down a bit? Like, just dig there. I don't know if that's gonna work. What I would like to do, if we can, now, I don't know if this is going to work or not, but if we can kind of make a, um, if we can kind of make a place for water there, I don't know if that's going to work or not. 
Dig a channel. Okay, we're gonna dig down. And hopefully that will... What I'm hoping to be able to do is to make uh, a place to have water, but I don't know if this is gonna work or not. And then we go down to that level and dig another channel. Save like here. Will that work? Basically a hole. I think there's a way to designate that in the zones as a kind of pit pond. No, that's for animals. If the pit is designated as a pond, your citizens will attempt to fill it with water using buckets. Okay, so I think like there, and then they should try and fill that with buckets, maybe. Designate this area as the top of the pond. Citizens will bring buckets of water if they if the pond below isn't filled with water. Yes. So you can fill that with water maybe with buckets. I don't know if that's gonna Oh, it's got a wheelbarrow. I oh, know it's always collecting some objects. So that's blue at the moment, not because it's got water in it, but because uh the show depth of it. Temples are doing well. He's praying. He's actually praying. To uh Uzol. No worshippers. Well, to a thousand fanciness though, which is good. So we've got one chest in the area. So there's no worshippers, but um, we just saw somebody praying, so. A masterpiece figurine has been created, lovely. Oh, it's been fighting. Who's fighting? Oh, what, there's a combat log thing, thing here. Where is, where is it happening? Somewhere around here, outside, just outside the fort. The flying copper bolt struck, strikes a black bear in the lower body. Oh, this is, this is like an old one. That bear from the old ages ago. I think the new one might be down here. Unless, it, unless he's all now. A tendon in the lower spine has been torn. This is our dwarf, I think. Mark's dwarf. Has the, has the tide turned? I laugh in the face of death. The flying copper bolt strikes up. I guess it was this one. Oh yeah, this guy here. Having the muscle and, and tearing the right no, kidney. Is that our dwarf? Who is this? Who is this guy? Zazit. No, that's Zazit Umal again. And this is... No, it's somebody else. Same name. Uh, yeah, that was that. That was that long time ago when I don't know which one it's referring to now. What happened just recently? Dehydrated. Everyone's dehydrated. Are people going to start dying again because of the de the uh, dehydration? Oh, it's saving. Is that a new season? It's early spring. I wonder if we can dig a channel just to just try and get some water here. Just maybe get some water. Just dig like here. Hopefully that will break the ice, uh, and water will be drinkable there, I don't know. These guys are thirsty. Okay, hopefully this area will fill up with water. That won't free immediately freeze. Is this, is this water? Snow-covered ice. Glacial upward slope. No, it stayed ice. Okay, that's going to be interesting when it kind of falls out. Plant gathering, please. Over here. Over here. All of this. Everybody gathers plants, come on. He's gathering plants. Hopefully it's something we can uh, drink. I think they're going for the cabbage. Like, oh no, what's this one? Oh no, an alert. <gasps> our cook, has, uh, of all people, our cook has been found dead. Dehydrated. No. Died at the carpenter's workshop. Oh, craps. We're down to 13 dwarves. I don't know what happened to the... I guess we lost two. I guess there's another one not hanging around. I feel we're gonna have to make some more of these. While we've got people alive to dig them, we might as well make some more as well. Oh my god. It's come to this again. Oh, not another dead person. Died while gathering berries. More people being found dead. Just people just dropping like flies. Need the need some water. Why did why does it freeze? Why did the tutorial put us in the place that it freezes? Is this how it ends? The great dehydration in the year one hundred and two. Two more dwarves found dead. These guys are trying to brew this guy's trying to brew from uh plant matter and a steel. Oh, he's actually in there doing it now. Come on! Be the saviour of the fort! Brew! Bro, my friend, I'm sure you're dehydrated as well. You're, you are dehydrated. You are dehydrated. Have you made anything? We've got five drinks. We've got five drinks. It's only 11 dwarves. Come on. 
What are you doing now? Brew, yes, brew some more. Brew and drink from plants. Where's he gone? Oh, he's gonna drink. He's gone to drink. So at least our brewer won't die from dehydration. Hopefully. We're, hopefully he's dehydrated. Yeah, he's healthy, he's healthy. Go to brew more. Where are you going now? Store item in the bin. Oh, he's gone back to brew some more. Okay, this guy might be the saviour. Three drinks. Oh, people are dying still. Or being found dead. A child has been found dead. Dehydrated. Uh, down to 10 population, guys. 10 population. Brew more drinks. This is really not good. This is uh, obviously quite bad for morale. <laughs> Every year we face a dehydration. Because we ran out of seeds. It's conducting a meeting, probably about the complete lack of, uh, of, of anything to drink in the place. Can you just make a lot of alcohol? Brew and drink from plant. What plant are you using? Oh man. Our carpenter's dead, no. <laughs> I just can't deal with it. Oh, down to two. Two, and. Uh, oh man, people are just laying dead everywhere. What is this? A pile of vomit. Where, where's that happen from? What's that come from? Down to nine dwarves. We need summer so we can start. Um, what, what? Oh, everybody's vomiting everywhere. It's because there's dead bodies here. Oh, hang on. We're going to have to start burying people. You're doing something. Are you dehydrated? Are you healthy? You really should be making more alcohol, but hopefully somebody else is doing it. Okay, we've got eight drinks now. Eight drinks, nine dwarves. Hopefully we can have one each. Stop dying. Burial. Put that there. Or oh, we haven't got any coffins. We're going to have to make coffins. Hopefully they'll make some rock coffins now. Okay, so we told us to make some rock coffins. Hopefully like, somebody gets around to doing that before they die. <laughs> We got about ten drinks now. We got ten drinks. Oh man, yeah, winter's been pretty harsh for us. Yeah, we've got twenty drinks now. I don't. We're starting to brew from a plant. I don't know what we're using to brew with. A human is visiting. Okay, so somebody's visiting again. That's nice. Uh, yeah, morale's pretty low now at the moment, so it's not the best. Oh, is this a human? Maybe he'll stay. Really could do with. Uh, Somebody, like a trader, coming by and selling the seeds. I think all we need is an endless supply of um, plump helmet seeds to survive. Okay, back to 30 drinks now. Okay, this is some. This has been some bad times. This has been some bad times. But hopefully, in the next episode, we can get this water and put it in this pit here as a kind of reserve so it doesn't happen again the worst case we run out of alcohol hopefully we can then make up make the uh the tavern more fancy look there's a human bard in there at the moment hopefully we can bury all the dead people the dead dwarves and hopefully but unlikely we can actually finish this wall off find out all this and more in the next episode of dwarf fortress and until next time i've been Parthos. you've been awesome goodbye leave me tips hints and advice in the comments please thank you